Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how you can create a fast forward effect using Final Cut Pro X. Uh, this might look like this. And now I'll show you how to do this. Let's switch to Final Cut. First, this is the clip I've chosen. It's uh, filmed in 120p. So we can create a 4 times slow motion effect. Um, first, let's create a new project. Let's call it fast forward effect. Set it to 1080. Okay. Now drag the clip into it and important the music. Now the first thing you have to do is to slow it down to 25% if you filmed it in 100 or 120p. Now let's zoom in a bit. So we have enough space to work. The first thing you have to do is um, to choose the part of the clip you want to use. In this case it's this one, so let's cut it here and here. Do it a bit quick, quicker. Check the music in again. So zoom in again. We want more space. So now it's important to use the sound of the music to set the cuts or to change the music. So let's play it. You can hear the claps like here. So we want to use this one but we want to set a cut here. So we have to get the clip to the cut. Oh. No. This is easier for me. So now we have a cut at the clap, so like this. Now choose the part where you want to enter fast forward effect. So in this case here. Choose it, set it to four times forward or faster. Now what you have is a fast forward effect at the clap. Ah, it's not perfect, zoom in again. Because you want it perfectly at the. So, what we do is drag it to the clap, play it again. Now it's perfect. And here's another one. So, we can set another fast forward effect at this point. So, cut it here. Go about this forward, set it to four times faster, make it perfectly to the clap, and now there's another one, let's do it again. Set a cut, go forward, now time we want to do a bigger one now. Or not? Ah, no, let's choose this size. Do it again, four times forward. Set it perfectly to the. Uh, all like this. So here's another one. I thought this is gonna be the last one. Another. Set another cut. Choose the clip about this space and now drag it to the clip. Drag it to the clip, so like this. And now what we have is a clip with four fast forward effects. looks very nice. That's it, it's very easy so so everybody can do this and it uh, will give the 
the, uh, the final clip or movie a nice effect. Don't forget to subscribe to get more tutorials about uh, Final Cut and uh, some nice little movies. Thank you.